Hello and welcome back. I'm Wolfgang Rieber. This is your second trick. I trust you enjoyed your paper clips yesterday. That was really easy to do. This one is as well, but it's going to make you appear like a maths genius. It's really a phenomenal effect. Very few people know about this trick and the formulas. I'm going to show it to you without somebody present. Obviously, you need to do it with a spectator, but I'm sure you're going to see what I mean. And we'll just make as if you're doing this now, watching me. You need a piece of paper or as I've got a flip chart. You ask a spectator to write down any five-digit number. So in this case, I'm going to write over there, let's see, 72189. They can write down any number. You immediately turn around, look at it, and you're going to make a prediction. I have a board here on which I'm going to write my prediction. So 72189. So I'm going to go to yes, yes, yeah, 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 and there. I'm going to leave it on my flip chart over there. Now, you don't have to look at the stage. You can look away and have your back turned. You ask the spectator to write another two numbers underneath that. So they will write whatever they want to over there, and they can do any other numbers. It really doesn't matter what they write, and we do that like that. At this point, they've now written down three numbers. You haven't had a chance to calculate anything in your mind as yet. You tell them you're going to turn around and you're going to write another two numbers instantly underneath there. So you're going to turn around instantly add another two numbers. And that's what I'm going to do for you now so that you can see how it works in real life. I turn around, I go OK, and I write down numbers like that. Then I write down another uh, number like that. You ask the spectator to total this up. You must remember that they've done this pretty much on their own. You turn around, you quickly wrote numbers, they add them up. The total that they get now when they add this up will be 272187. That'll be the total. See how quick I can add up. Obviously when you do it, you, you, you add up. If you don't believe me, you can see 9 and 8 is 17, 4 is 21, and 1 is 2, and 5 is 7, 7 carry 2. It adds up to that. My prediction I made earlier on says over there, 272187. 272187. I knew the outcome right from the first number. How's that for freaky? Would you like me to explain it to you? It's really simple when you know how. I've seen other magicians do this, and the method they use, you can kind of figure out. I've added a bit of a twist. So let's start. We'll start with a new sheet as well. Here goes. You have a sheet of paper, you can do it at a table, you can do it on stage, anywhere. And you have a sheet of paper or a board that you're going to write your prediction on. You ask for any number, it doesn't matter. So let's say they go 45819. You now write a prediction. Your prediction is as follows. You're going to add a 2 in front of the number. You always just add a 2 and you're going to subtract a 2 from that number. So in other words, my prediction will be now, if that's the number, 2, I add before, 4, 5, 8, 1. From the last number, I subtract 2, which is 9 minus 2, 7. Had the last number not been a 9, but a 1. You can't subtract 2 from 1. Then you take the number before that, so 1 and 1 would be 11, minus 2 would then be 9, would be 0, 9. Just bear that in mind. So the secret of this whole illusion, the first part, is you put a 2 before and you subtract a 2 from the end. You ready? And that's your prediction there. Now you can turn around. You can look away. You can ask the spectator, write down any two other five-digit numbers, which they do. So I'm going to make this easy so you understand how it works. I'm just going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then underneath I'm going to just do something different. 4, 5, 0, 5, 4. Only now do you turn around and you instantly add another two numbers. Now watch. As I turn around, I now write. Now watch what I'm doing here. Uh-huh. There, 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 there. Then I write another number like this. And now if you total it up, you will see 9 and 5 is 14, 18, 22, 27. There's 7 over there. And as we go along, you'll see that that actually does add up to this number. How does it work? 
Now, normally, when I've seen magicians do this, they've asked the spectator to write one number, then they write their number, then the spectator writes another one, and they write theirs. Then it's kind of obvious. By getting the spectator to write their three numbers down first, you hide the secret. What actually happens is that these pairs, the first, the second number he's written or she's written, and your first number add up to nine, and so does that pair add up to nine. So they've written one, two, three, four, five over there. The first number you write is you want the numbers that you write and their number to add up to nine. So eight and one is nine, seven and two is nine, six and three is nine, five and four is nine, four and five is nine. See how clever that is? The second number I write down, again, five and four is nine, five and four is nine, zero and nine is nine, five and four is nine. I use this example so you can see. So all you're doing is your two numbers have just got to add up to nine. And then the entire trick works on its own. See how simple it is. If you want to learn more tricks like that, I've got a website called mindskillsforyou.com where I actually teach you memory techniques and math skills. There's a free example of some great stuff you can instantly learn to improve your memory. And there's some advanced courses as well. I would check that out if I was you. There's some fun stuff there. Thank you so much for watching the second trick. I trust you are going to have an immense amount of fun with this and everybody's going to think you're a math genius. And I'll see you tomorrow with the next trick, which is all about a string and a straw.